Hey everyone, uh, this is a quick video on how to clean the pump on your hot point in the set of Creta condenser tumble dryer. Um, a lot of fluff gets in here blocking up the, uh, the pump, stopping the water from pumping up into the water chamber. So look, the, these, first of all remove these two hoses, your black hose and your white hose. They just pop out here, pull them up. One, two, okay. Here you have two clips, here and here. Just put in a flathead screwdriver maybe in behind them and just, just be careful when you're open because they can break. And then nice just wiggle it around until it, until it pops open. There you go, it's one anyway. And do the same with the other side. Two. Okay, just pull it up towards you. There we go. Okay. There you have your pump. Now this is this is pretty clean. Sometimes as well, if the pump isn't pumping water up, just check under here. Under here, you might be able to see now there's a there's a little um propeller. I can see it here. It gets purred sometimes. Make sure that's on properly. It's a it's either a rubber that jobs. There's a rubber propeller really on these or or a sorry, sometimes it's a plastic one as well. But just make sure they're on properly and they're not blocked up. Make sure this is opening up and down, fine. There's a there's a switch inside there that that, that activates the um the machine to turn off. It'll say empty water if that is stuck in the up position. So just make sure that is um not stuck up like that, okay? Uh, in here, in here, make sure that's all cleaned out. I'll just move the phone here to show you. It is, it's a small bit dirty, but it's not as bad as I've seen them. So, in here, you might see it a bit better. Okay, it's a bit dirty in there. In the very bottom left hand corner here, as you're looking in, is, sorry, a cat got my attention, is just, just down in here. Is where the water comes down in here and into the pump. Sometimes it's worth giving that a clean if the water isn't getting down in there. I use a cable tie, just fits in nicely, give it a clean, make sure there's nothing and there's not either because I cleaned it from the inside already. But just give it a clean, make sure the sometimes people put a little cup of water down in inside. So you actually got a little bit more fluff out there. Some people um, put a cup of water down inside just to make sure the water is coming in through here. So yeah, that's it. Again, a quick uh, recap, just make sure it's clean in here. Give that a little clean with a cable tie, make sure there's nothing stuck in there. Make sure the propeller on your on your pump under here is free and it's not broken off. And make sure here this um the switch for the um my mind is gone now, but it, it disactivates when 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 if there's water in the chamber here, it'll just stay up and it'll come up, it'll give you the it'll give the error on the front of the machine that the uh, water tank is full when it when it's not. It's actually this is the problem. So sometimes, if that is the problem, if this skin problem is, you're nearly better off buying the whole unit. It's probably 20 or 30 euro. Um, very easy to change, it's just a couple of wires. Um, I'll just show you. In here, look. Just a couple of wires. So you've your, you've one going to the top of this, you've got one going to the middle, and you've one going to the bottom, and you've your two here going to your pump. It doesn't matter which way these ones go in. Uh, the pump will work either way. Um, yeah, so look, that's the video of it. I hope it was helpful. If it was, please give me a like and maybe subscribe. And um, it'd be great if you subscribed, help me if channel a bit. Uh, if you have any questions or anything, just um, comment in the comment section and I will get back to you ASAP um, because I, I am watching the page all the time. So I will be back to you straight away. All right, listen, have a good day and thanks for watching and take care. Thank you. Bye bye.